So now we're going to go on to the three six. This is the martyr slash role model in traditional human design. And then quantum is the explorer slash adept. Adept? Adept. Yes. Somebody who's just naturally good at something, right? The adept. They have wisdom, expertise, knowledge. And so the line six has most notably the triphasic, they call it, life cycle that in the first um, 30 years, they live more like a, a line three, lots of experimenting. So as you can see with this three, six, there's going to be this double experimenting, a lot of experimenting early up until yeah. about age 30. Like I said, trial and error approach to most things. They struggle with indecision a lot. So some trust issues there, a lot of need for well, like I say, that trust and kind of perfection in relationships. There's so, so like the the line three has a reputation in relationships, bonds made and broken, meaning they they will bond with people, but then if things aren't working, they're ready to, you know, cut and run if something isn't. They'll just try something new mm-hmm. because they have this trial, try and error, trial and error energy. But the line six has a long view on life. The line six is in deep down always kind of longing for more of a soulmate. So they tend to, um, they can overlook certain things or hope for the best. It's a more positive outlook on life because they see more of a long view. So there's going to be this, again, this energy that kind of is at odds within them at times. So some famous three sixes are Mariah Carey, Dustin Hoffman, Tina Fey, and Carrie Underwood. So all right, so the the three six, uh, these are people who are basically their lives. They're on a, a quest for truth through experimentation, but then they also have their own innate knowing that causes them to kind of be detached and observant. So they really are looking through that line six of them. Line six aspect of them is looking through truth through uh, living in alignment with their own authentic self because as a role model moves through life they that's ultimately what they end up modeling is what it means to be yourself right to be this expression of yourself so in that first 30 years or so of a three six there's that there's that double line three energy so there is going to be a lot of experimenting lots of encountering or entering into relationships breaking relationships um from 30 to 50 they say that the there's a little bit of a break there on that experimenting because the line six in there in that time frame that second part of the triphasic second phase Mm -hmm. is when they go up on the roof and they kind of withdraw so it it gives that line six energy a little bit more time to sort of take the lead to just observe and to just um maybe settle down in relationships, maybe spend a little more time trying to cultivate those relationships, like not just cut them off so severely if they're not working. Mm-hmm. And and in general in line with line sixes is, is that time of their life is if if there has been a lot of experimenting or moving around that they tend to just kind of step back and rest. <laughs> and see how everybody else does it you know but it's not like a time where they do nothing they are a time when they build families maybe a line Mm -hmm. six if they are looking for that soulmate might be when they meet someone because they're then able to give it more time you know somebody they may have encountered in the first phase of their life they may not have given the time they may have seen the flaws straight up and just be like i'm done with it but Mm -hmm. now in this second stage of life they're ready to give it a little bit more time to see if maybe there's something that can be worked on yeah like you said so after 50 was when the line six is supposed to come down off the roof supposed to meaning they're supposed to re-engage with life in the sense that they take everything they've learned through their own life experimentation but also through just observing this um what it means to to be yourself and to live in alignment with yourself and to be authentic so uh the three six has the gift of embodying wisdom through how they live their life they are an example they're a role model and they 
call the rest of us to be authentically ourselves. That's that role modeling part of it is that you don't have to actually actively try to be a role model to someone like big brother, big sister kind of thing. It's just, you're here as a line six to try lots of things, see how you want to do it, see how others do it, heal from all your experiences, integrate. And then as you emerge in the later stage of your life, just be yourself and that is the role model part of you but with this combination three six there's just gonna be a lot more experimenting (laughs) a lot (laughs) and always that pull of wanting to like break bonds and just be done with it and move on you know and not just romantic relationships any kind of situations you want to just kind Mm -hmm. of like stop working let's just try something else let's move on but the six is like no let's just see what happens let's stick with this we know that this is Mm -hmm. a process we know that you have to be you know patient take your time long view on life type of thing so anyways Mm -hmm. so the role model or excuse me in this instance with this pairing this really the three six can show us that life can throw you lots of curveballs there can be a lot of bumps along the road right but these are things that are here to teach you and if you just stay the course keep moving forward you'll get the truth of like who you really are and what it means to be authentically yourself as an example for others does that make sense Mm mm-hmm so like I said, I think we've pretty much covered this, but the challenges here for a line are for this profile in particular, the three six, is that tendency to have high expectations in relationships and partners because they are line six is looking for a soulmate. So they mm-hmm. really want to feel that they have people that they trust and can feel safe with. They're looking for stability, which they themselves have that kind of with that long view, that high ideal of what's possible for all of us, they can tend to, you know, expect that from everybody. The line three part of them, like I said, can be a little messy, a little daring, but the line six wants to be a little more stable and more steady. (laughs) So there's a little bit. They say there's a push pull between like pessimism and positivity within the three six. Mm. It's like, cut and run no no they can be better they can do this (laughs) as we said before six is more aware of others (laughs) three is more self-absorbed absorbed so again this is still a right angle cross personality they have personal destiny destiny even though they have that line six aspect essentially Mm -hmm. they are here to learn from their own experience and of life so that's the three six okay 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 